we went to Kaiser Permanente's IVF clinic. And after a couple of tries, I gave you that phone call and I was, I was through the moon. I a lot of tears. It was a couple of days. I felt a lot of pressure. Then it was to the point where I said uh, the pressure was intermittently every few minutes. We had to go to the ER and figure out where the pain was coming from. And to find out that she actually was going in labor was definitely a shock. Emily arrived here at 24 weeks gestation in premature labor and proceeded to deliver both of the twins at a very young gestation. They're the tiniest babies that I've ever seen in my entire life. Uh, they weigh uh, roughly one and a half pounds. Babies born earlier than this generally don't survive. At best, they had a 70% chance of survival. It's not your typical experience where you get to hold them right after they're born. You're just praying that they can uh, survive the next you know, 24 hours. All right, I know this is gonna be a long road, but we're where we need to be. Here in Northern California, Kaiser has seven level three neonatal intensive care units. We do have neonatal physicians here 24 seven who can then respond and adjust the treatment based on the needs of the infant. The twins stayed in our unit for 16 weeks. Ella experienced a small bleeding in the brain that did totally resolve before she went home. Evie did experience the issue of eye changes associated with a premature baby, requiring a laser operation to her eyes. The babies were very fortunate to make it through an extreme premature state. Those issues with medical support and care did resolve. September 1st was the day we went home. They got to come home together. They're right on track. They're doing amazing. Um, you know, when we first came home, they were on supplemental oxygen and they had apnea monitors. We're no longer using either of those. We keep talking every day now. They just look like regular babies now. Thank you for loving my girls. They truly treated us like family. Taking it, making it not feel like a medical setting meant more than anything. I look at them and they cry and they're loud and they smile. I'm so thankful. They're a miracle. <laughs>